Hey everybody, it's Scott Barnes here with Homemade. Uh, I want to show you a project I was working on, or I've been working on. It is actually a kettle or a hot dog cart um, that I was going to make for a kettle corn cart. But after having a couple kids, you know, it's just it's not working right now. So I've actually turned this thing into a prepper um, storage unit, I guess, if you if you will. And um, so if anything kind of happens or I don't know, a flood or whatever, solar flare, I don't know, um, economy collapse, who, who knows. Uh, yeah, we're about five minutes from the mountains. I can take this thing and kind of survive off it, I guess. So this part's going to be my food storage. As you can see, I just started doing this. So every time I go to the supermarket, I get a couple cans here and there. And, and this side is going to be clothes, medical kit. I already got a binder about, I recommend you guys looking up. It's got all the survival tips. I think it's like 223 pages worth of survival tips. So, so medical and food, clothes on this side, and then rations on this side and then what was cool is with this hot dog cart you know ask for so I, I guess you <laughs> wash things dishes I guess and then um, this is also for the hot water so it came with a hot water heater and just my propane tank is going to go right there um, so if I need to use that for heating stuff up or what have you and then what it also called for was on the plants was to put water storage so if anything happens you know I got I think they're five gallons each and then I got two five gallon two seven gallons there's one on this side and there's one on the other and I put a pump system in it I don't know if you can see it in there let's see if I can bring it up now but anyway I put a pump system back there so and then I found on Harbor Freight that you can buy a solar like a small solar system for a couple hundred bucks. So I'm going to kind of see if I can attach it. So it's kind of if I got electricity and so there's, there's the other side. So I also got the trailer from Harbor Freight. It was like 200 bucks. So this whole thing cost me about 500 bucks to make. You know, it was going to be a, a job, but you know, after <laughs> doing some research about kind of like what's going on and time. It's just good to be ready to go just in case anything happens. So that's my small little prepper storage unit, mobile storage unit. So anyway, just thought I'd share. So if you got any comments or likes, go ahead and put them below. Have a good day.